Hello, my name is Josiah Ray. I'm going to show you how to get a wiggle effect using Adobe After Effects. Uh, this is great for things like an earthquake or a grenade going off, all the way over to when you want a really bumpy animation, but you'd like it to be a little bit more organic and you don't really want to have to animate every keyframe. I've also used it on a white layer set to like a color burn or something like that to create a pulsing look for energy. So let's take a quick look. Here I've got an, an empty composition here, and what I'm going to do is create a new layer. And we'll make a nice orange layer. And I'm going to create just a box, so a square mask. There we go. Or excuse me, a rectangular mask. I'm going to set this so that it kind of jitters and jumps around right where it's sitting. So let's click on the layer and press P for the position. And I'm going to come to the very beginning and set a keyframe. We'll go to the very end set another keyframe. We'll come over to the wiggler and I'm going to highlight both keyframes and you notice the wiggler kind of opens up the options that you've got to work with. You can choose frequency and magnitude. The frequency of 5 looks great. I'm going to set the magnitude to about 10 and click apply. And you see it automatically generates all those keyframes in between. And if we play this you see it bounces and jiggles around and you can set this to a really fast, tight jiggle or really, really kind of uh, longer intervals with much more magnitude for a looser wiggle. I hope you've enjoyed this quick video on how to use the wiggler in Adobe After Effects. I'm Josiah Ray.